The Hatfield and McCoy Foundation will be hosting the first Hatfield and McCoy Homecoming Festival October 6th through the 9th to celebrate the 20-year anniversary of the two families signing the peace treaty. The festival will be held in downtown Williamson and all proceeds will go to the Hatfield and McCoy Foundation. It's just been announced that it is going to be the 20th year reunion of our peace treaty signing that was actually held in Pikeville. Um, it got a lot of media attention back then, um, you know, that we came to a truce and we are celebrating 20 years of peace um, and trying to, of course, keep that for many more generations to come. The nonprofit foundation was formed in 2016 with the goal of preserving the feud heritage sites and promoting the family's legacy while conveying their message of peace, love, diversity, inclusion, acceptance, and togetherness. This event is actually going to be our biggest fundraiser of the year for uh, the foundation. What is behind me, of course, is our museum and headquarters. So the land that you're standing on here today, where the museum is located, is um, De Valance's last home place. Uh, so he settled here and hid out here during the feud and settled here um, after the feud. And um, we decided that this would be the, the natural headquarters for the foundation and we're starting the museum here. Um, we will be expanding greatly, um, but currently right now we have the museum and a gift shop. Soon we'll have a uh, nice food truck addition and a much larger space for the museum as well. We are Pikeville Medical Center and we are an amazing place to work. Healthcare heroes of all types work here, all who deserve great rewards. So while our heroes are working hard to take care of our patients and visitors, we are taking care of them with top tier benefits, higher pay rates, and great sign on bonuses. So join our team today. So what are you waiting for? Apply today. Incredible opportunities await at pmcjobs.org. In the wake of 9-11, Rio Hatfield and Ron McCoy felt it was necessary to demonstrate unity to the American people and sign the historic truce in 2003 as a public demonstration of the power of unity. The festival will highlight the history of the feud while celebrating the 20 years of peace between the families. Well, uh, for the uh, festival, actually, we are just now opening up uh, sponsorships and vendor applications. Um, so we are looking for organizations who would like to sponsor the festival or people who would like to be a vendor at the festival. We do plan on having carnival rides um, on one end of uh, Williamson. On the other side, there's an ATV mud pit that they uh, built for dirt days. So we will be utilizing that. So we'll have carnival rides for the families going on, ATV events for the outdoors going on. On top of that, we're gonna have, of course, a lot of entertainment, a lot of music. Uh, we're going to have some old school um, competitions throughout the weekend. It's a long weekend. When you get to the festival, you can either sign up to be on the Hatfield family or the McCoy family. And at the end of the week, we will tally the points and see who won the, uh, the uh, feud for the weekend, I guess we'll say. And um, we are going to have a lot of vendors, food vendors, uh, craft vendors uh, kind of squeezed in the middle with the stage and entertainment. To apply to be a vendor or to sponsor the festival, visit HatfieldMcCoyFoundation.org or call Jack Hatfield at 304-896-1212. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.